if you're ever driving your scooter and it's shutting off on you when you come to a stop, so maybe you say you reach that first stop sign and it just dies out, um, very common first thing in the morning or within those first few minutes of you getting on your scooter when the motor is, is nice and cool and it hasn't had a chance to warm up yet, you pull up that first stop sign and it dies out. Now, you can just wait for a few minutes for it to warm up. A lot of the times what I do is when I jump on my scooter in the first 10 minutes, I don't like want to necessarily sit there and let it idle for 10 minutes and warm up, right? So what I'll do is when I come to a, when I come to a stop, I'll give it just enough gas. Like I can put, hold the brake handle and give it a little bit of gas, right? To keep it running when I'm at that stop sign. But if it's happening all the time, even when it's warm, like this scooter is dying out, like you can see it's about to die out when it's warm, you can actually adjust the idle by simply turning it up. So what you do, is open up your seat compartment here, pull everything out of the seat, and most of them have an access panel usually with one screw like this, and you just open it up. Right? And then you're gonna see the carb. So let me uh, wipe this off real quick. That's the idle screw right there. And what I'll do is I will start the scooter and hopefully Hopefully you'll be able to hear the difference. All right, so the scooter is running. It's gonna give this a very slight turn to the right. And the more I keep doing that, the higher it's going to rev. If I keep going. Hear that? So, if I keep going, it's gonna get higher and higher and higher and higher, right? So, I don't wanna turn it up too much because I, I don't want it to feel like it's pushing him through the stoplight or anything. But, obviously I want it to be high enough to where it's not going to die every time the customer stops. Or every time you stop. So good, it's right, right there. Little spray, look for the Look for the screw with the little spring on it. Just give it a slight turn to the right and that'll turn your idle up and you should be able to hear the difference when it's, when it's running. Now, since we're doing this, if you watch, if I continue to turn it up, you'll see the rear wheel starting to spin, right? So you see how it's just spinning on its own? It's getting enough gas to keep it running. Now your body weight, your, if, this is idling kind of high right now, but if I'm sitting on it, it's not gonna go anywhere because my body weight, the weight of the scooter is going to be holding it down in place. adjustment yeah anybody can do that <laughs>